Alright, let's keep this going. So, we just got through playing through Chicago, which was probably the darkest part of the entire freaking game. Let's hope not. And we're moving on to Notre Dame. Alright. I have no idea where Notre Dame is. I, I, I know that there's the Ir fighting Irish, which is just basically a leprechaun with his fists up. Which isn't really threatening. But... Alright. Watch this late at night, and you will be freaked out. Let's find out why. Isn't it kind of convenient where the tears are? You know, I have no idea why he kidnaps those women. I don't think it's rape. Date rape, date rape, oh my god. No. Alright, you are basically Viola, which is that chick. How the hell do I remember that crap? Anyway, so basically this level revolves around killing zombies. There's actually a spot on the zombie, it's like right below the head. Like, just barely. If you hit it just right, it's a one-shot kill, which is sweet. Yeah, actually, that was kind of where it's supposed to be, a little bit higher. Alright, now, <laughs> for, for first time I ever played this, I did not, could not find that switch. I, my uh, brother actually found it, and yes, I have one. But uh, he found it because, I don't know. Alright, let's go into the sewers, because... I kick ass like that. I guess. I, I don't know. I uh, The thing I don't understand, why is it that, like, knight's armor somehow makes you impenetrable to bullets? Pretty sure in V for Vendetta, he got shot with knight's armor and he died. Just throwing that out there. Alright, my favorite room in this entire place, the wine. Does that make me an alcoholic? No, I'm just kidding, I don't drink. No comment on the flaming zombies. You're coming with me. Thanks. Yeah, you can't kill them. Because it's a game over for whatever reason. I mean, that seems like kind of cheap, but yeah. You can shoot him, don't worry. I don't know if it's a one shot kill, but I'll test it later. <laughs> it's always hilarious when they try and hit you with their stubs. I don't think it hurts at all. Look at that. He thinks jabbing me with his not arm is gonna kill me. You worship wrong! Actually, I don't know if they worship at all. Time crystals on the altar. And of course, they're not gonna fire at you for whatever reason. I could make such a nasty joke right there. The worst part of the level, the spiraling staircase. Try not to throw up. Too easy. Well, I guess it would be since it's on easy mode. Just throwing that out there. Alright, now we go down, back down the spiraling stairs of throwing upness, I guess. I can't really think of a fun nickname. Alright, now here comes a fun part of the level, and I use the term fun somewhat loosely. Long story short, zombies come kill. Oh, but who's that guy? Who's that guy? Well, it's actually a hunchback of Notre Dame.
Ah. You never see that in zombie movies. Punch to the face, death. Damn you, Gear Del Toe. How you say his name, whoever made Dawn of the Dead or Day of the Dead. And... I don't know. It's actually kind of funny because he will shoot you if you get in his way for killing zombies. Which is kind of ironic for his character, but. Oh well. Come on, my dear. Let's go. If I was that chick, I would run. Two, one. Holy crap. That guy's. The hunchback's kind of freaking me out. And two, holy crap, zombies. I'm pretty sure women don't like zombies. Just saying. Hey, remember that from the opening scene? Ah, this is the easiest boss ever. Okay, when I fi fought this guy, I tried to test something. Can I use the Luger pistols to kill him? Guess what? It worked. Kinda of pathetic when you get killed by the worst weapon in the entire freaking game. I can't see a thing. Ah, there we go. More body armor I don't need. It's raining. Whoa, whoa, hang on. There's it's a clear sky and it's raining. Um okay. That's what I think of you, old man. Alright, let's hurry up and get out of this level. Here's a fun little extra. You can blow out the hell. Bye. Ha, you thought I was gone. Actually, yeah, you can blow up those things. Bye.